Hi, uh, this is Charlie Destries, a very quick survey because I'm curious about a couple of things that have to do with 3D cell culture plates. These are these new plates that have been on the market for the last couple of years. About a half a dozen companies or so are manufacturing them. Very, very different plates, but they look similar. You know, a typical cell culture plate or a micro plate uh, might look like this. You're probably used to seeing them in a 6 well or maybe 12, 24 well variety. And uh, But instead now we have these um, cell culture plates that have different kinds of materials that are coating the bottom of each well. So each of these cell culture plates are quite, quite different. And it's not just nitrocellulose backing on these plates, although some manufacturers may have that. These are real three-dimensional fibrous type materials that make the cells happy. The cells, whether you're doing stem cell work, cell culture, whatever it is, uh, screening, for example, the cells just seem to behave more naturally uh, in this kind of environment. But is it true? Are you seeing this? Have you tried it? What do you think? These guys are probably going to cost you a couple of bucks, right? These guys are going to cost you about $100 or so for a plate. So we're talking about 100x uh, or 50x or so on the plate price. But, you know, price is really kind of a funny thing, right? Is there something that it gives you, in your opinion, that makes it much, much more valuable than even what they're charging for these things? So thanks for doing my survey. It's very short, just a few questions. And I'm going to be sharing this information with you. If you answer the survey, just put your email at the end. And uh, we'll go from there. Thanks.